Hello and welcome to View Replays. This time it's with Mini Trucker 01. We just saw him in his T53 marking. This is another replay I acquired at the same time. It's on Glacier. So let's watch the skills from this young gentleman. We do know he has him from the tree mark game. I do think this is pre tree mark. But nevertheless, it's an excellent game, I'm sure. So let's watch it. And the uh, EBR makes it up there. Matchmaking is good. He's top tier. There's no Ardies, which makes laser even more fun. He has the good position here. This is a really good place for hitting some crossing uh, tonks. He hit 203, he's back on the reload. T50, of course, as I said, is also one of my favorite tanks for fun. So what can I say? A <laughs> bounce from the EBR. It's really annoying when an EBR or something makes it up there. They can really be annoying. So. It's good to see the one from the team makes it up there on the EBR as well. And he bounces again. He must have found that happy angle for the T50 because very armored it is not. Gets one more shot off, uh, crossing one. And that one didn't make it. There we go. Ooh. And now let's go to T50. He did get penned from, I believe, the Carnivore. I wasn't really paying attention. I was looking at the. Uh, there's a lot of tanks in front of him, so it's really good. His team is spread out pretty good, so they won't flank them from the left or the south. So all in all, I think they're in pretty good here. The problem could be that heavy corner is a little bit thinly populated, but there is some TDs in the back there for, to be precise, which should also help them if they push over the middle, which I don't think they will. He really wants to get some shots into... Uh, these guys, there was one more. TS5 bounced them. Has to be really careful with that Carnivore though. Romix 7 seems to be in love with our young mini trucker here. I'm still on vacation, so if you share the link, try to get some views for me, I would be very, very in love with you. Or something like that, you know what I mean. He's looking anxiously up there to see if, uh, and there he was, the EBR comes up there. So, that was the end of the EBR. Thanks for playing. That was a good tank to get out. So now, the high ground is clear. Which makes life a lot easier here. I actually don't think the Carnivore has uh, as much as moved one bit there. He seems pretty stuck on... Uh, wanted to deliver some more shots to this young gentleman. And as I kind of predicted, it looks like the heavy corner is going to be lost here. So, we'll see what Mini Trucker does. I mean, as I said, there is some good cover behind. You could also push over the middle. 704 that's not spotted, a 5120 is not spotted. And there's RHM. It is some nasty tanks to be caught in the open with, so... Should try not to be caught by them. You don't see a lot of 5120s anymore, to be honest. They are also a little bit underpowered. Oop, and there he was, not even looking here. That could be fatal. And he gets the second kill in Mini Trucker. Can he get one in the Lance as well? Yes, yes, yes. Only shame is he doesn't have a full clip. He makes it up to 2500 damage. And he goes up the ramp. This could be excellent for some uh, shooting from the above party. I at least know it's very annoying when somebody gets up here on a medium and you're standing there and you're heavy. Oh yeah, this is gonna be good. He spotted though, but... Oh, E75 don't seem to care. The trick here is to not overpeak so they can hit you. Now he's reloading for 20 seconds, so E75 gets all the time in the world to forget him. And he gets unspotted. Load it in a second. Is he peeking on him? What? There we go. And that should be the third kill. Very well played. Almost 4k. 112 assist, which is not that important right here. One of the important thing is you can actually run out of ammo in this tank. So, in my book, don't waste them. Oh. The Pantera is trying to creep up behind him, but I don't think that's going to be possible. 
Can you actually hit him there? Yes, if you can get the shot in. Nope. One more shot. And the fourth kill. So, 4300 damage. Excellent play. And Mini Truckers team has backed totally up around that area, so... It's almost time to uh, start farming their base over there. So the 704 and the 5120 has been spotted over there, of course. And also a SU, which is an excellent target for a T-50. But first they need to get that Carnivore out. The Romix guy. And there he is. Let's see if Mini... Nope. There he is. My fault. Didn't manage to track him. Oh, he tracked him there. He did manage to get three shots in. So 5,243, 441 assist. For those of you who don't know, up here is an excellent spot. If you want to get behind the enemy, do be careful about being spotted because you will be wrecked from the base. And there they are. One. Oh, he should probably move. Well, two out of three is good. He's up to, well, a little bit short of 6k, a little bit short of 1k spotting. I really like the way that. Uh, this young mini truck at rhymes. It's aggressive as needed. Well, don't know if that's the right way to put it. But he is aggressive when it's needed and he don't overextend. Not in the replays he sent me at least, so. Pantera's out. Can he actually hit? Yeah, he's gonna be in the open. Yes. Nice shot. Uh, well, two out of three is good. Didn't get spotted. Six and a half K and almost 1500 assists. Well, 1400, but who's counting? Again, remember to join in on Discord, Patreon, whatever you want. The way you want to support is cool. If you don't want to support, it's also cool. There is no demand. All the links are, of course, in the description. I might. I'm considering a new series, so if you send me replays, could you say if it's alright if I put it in uh, a voting, two replays against each other and people can vote? It's not to put anyone down, it's just for the fun of it, really. And the SU, I don't think he'll get the gun down here. Uh, whoops, something was there. Well, there's three tanks left, so it's 12 to 10. Of course, they're about 2k ahead. So it's not too bad. And there was one. Come on. So the 5120, the top tier autoloader, decided to stay totally in the back. Hmm. Well, well, different folks, different strokes. This was a stroke I would not have taken. But there we go. This is kind of the good things about World Tanks. Everybody's different. Which is also one of the bad things, but... Imagine a world where everybody was the same. That would be bad. Ooh. Can I get one more in? Seven kills to Mr. Mini Trucker here. And he made it up to 8,638 damage. There's of course one tank left. And he's right there. So who will reload the fastest? He can't really take one more shot, can he? But he gets... One more, one more, one more. Yeah. So 8 kills to Mini Trucker. Very well played. He's doing a rotation happiness dance. Can't really blame him. So let's have a look at that result. Of course you got a Mastery, Cribble Crabble, you got a Ready Walders, High Caliber, Tank Sniper and a Top Gun. He managed to rake up 9074 and 8 kills. His friend in the 5120 the other team managed to make 1700. Well played. And he also got 1,418 assists, 8 bonds, it came to a minus of 15,992, and base XP of 1,896. Well, thanks a lot for seeing the replay, Minitrager. I really enjoyed it. And to the rest of you, I'll see you after the vacation. English one with a Russian one, but man pulled up in the German one. Two four fours in a four-door truck, there's one on the right, on the left, there's one. We don't wait for the...